Shitty games, please! Oh. Wait, what the fuck? Oh! All right, what is up? This is Slow Plays, and welcome back to another Wild Wednesday. We are here for. One of probably the worst Dragon Ball games of all time. You're looking at it right now. <laughs> what the actual hell is this game? I don't I don't even understand. So Dragon Ball Z Taiketsu. I believe this was released back in 2003. Let's 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 just jump into it. So this is a game that came out on the Game Boy Advance. And like I said, it's notorious for its horrible controls and difficulty to pull off special moves. Now that's the main reason why I don't like it. Y'all can disagree, agree, whatever it may be. Um, there are some cool aspects to this game. The music is a banger, so we'll definitely check that out. But let's let's go ahead and jump into um, the, the, the training. I wanna show you guys at least a little bit of single player. If you guys wouldn't mind dropping a like, leaving a like, subscribing here on the channel as well, um, showing your support, it is so appreciated. If we can reach over 700 likes on this video, I'll do another video where I try and, I guess, do some of the worst games. Uh, Y'all requested that I do Taiketsu uh, from, you know, the last time when I did Battle of the Z. So we're going to go ahead and jump into uh, all the modes that you have. So you got a tournament mode, you have Endurance, which I assume is like, I don't know, you, you just keep going with the same amount of health maybe? I don't know. I never really did any of these modes. Um, time Challenge sparring which was the only mode i freaking did and endure it two times times two um i haven't even done times one so unless unless i did this one at one point i don't think i would even do this one but yeah sparring was literally the only mode i liked there wasn't really much of a uh, story mode there was kind of just like i guess tournament in a way but let's go ahead let's let's jump <laughs> let's jump into the sport so um shout outs to cheats shout outs to code junkies i went ahead and unlocked all the characters so the character roster that you have by default is going to be goku gohan piccolo krillin android 18 which pff, that hairline bruh um my boy trunks out here uh we have vegeta with the biggest head in the world oh my god he looks like one of those troll dolls, bruh. And then we also have a uh, random, which is my favorite character. I love random. So the unlockable characters will be Frieza, which for some reason he's in his first form. But I guess because there are transformations in this game. When you pull off special moves, you get a transformation. Then we have Android number 16, which, I mean, that's cool, but it's random as hell. Uh, you gotta have Cell. Again, they all have transformations, so they're all in their, like, their base form. So it's imperfect Cell, which I think is pretty badass. Uh, Gotenks, you know, makes his appearance. And we also have Fat Boo. Then we got my boy Broly Swally! So, uh, he's actually in Super Saiyan, which is pretty cool. Again, always, uh, I give respect and props to the games that actually give the characters, uh, I mean, at least all of their forms or a majority of them. So, seeing him in his Super Saiyan form is pretty sick with the blue hair. He was the original Super Saiyan Blue, let's be real. Uh, we got Nappa! Yes, my boy out here, Ghost Nappa! Ah! And then we got my boy Raditz. So that is pretty cool. Um, in terms of the actual, like, just models, I mean, I used to shit on them. They look a lot better than they used to. Krillin looked like he got something stuck up his ass. Uh, same thing with Vegeta here. Like, they they look they all look like they they got something like a stick up their ass, honestly. So um I just like how Gohan is great salmon, Gohan. That's that's just awesome. So let's let's just be Goku. Let's try to pull off some special moves. I guess I'll fight Vegeta here. So yeah, this song, listen to this song, it's, it's, it's a banger, but after trying to go into training for like 300 years to figure out these moves, I mean, it's whatever, so I'll show you guys what we have, so right here, you got a <laughs> look at the kick, what is that, it's so stiff, there's, you, there's like no momentum, like you can't carry any momentum, here's a, here's a punch, okay, so I'm punching him. Um, yeah, it's 
I mean, it runs pretty good. Like the the animations and everything are smooth. But here's here's a down punch. Here's a here's a trip kick. So you got the little trip kick going on there. Uh, do we have? I think there's like a. Is there a way to uppercut? I don't think so. No, no. Oh no, there's the uppercut. All right. So yeah. Um, you know what this reminds me of? It's um. I think they were trying to go for almost like a Mortal Kombat style, like the original arcade Mortal Kombat. So you got this like i guess heavy kick or whatever it looks so bad like the animations were very stiff but they were at least like i mean you can see like it's running in like a clean like 60 fps or whatever but that nut shot yeah they, they're nut shots hell yes they're nut shots um yeah they, there's nothing else you just have a couple different punches you have your uppercut you have this stupid ass kick you have an air kick uh, you have an air punch. I mean, if you can even land it, like, okay, that, that didn't even look like it connected, but it did. But whatever. Um, if you hold L and R at the same time, you actually charge your key up. So, just like fighters and just most, I guess, like, fighting games, um, this was a game that had level 1s, level 2s, and all that good stuff. So, um, the good thing is, on my phone right here, I actually did pull up all of the ultimates, Goku's Kamehameha, it's down forward down forward b so let's let's try that out okay so it's down forward down forward b all right so i'm just gonna match hey we pull it off first try let's go so he goes super saiyan vegeta just dies right there he goes super saiyan you're able to pull that off so that's actually sick that's dope that looked pretty cool so that's just a normal Kamehameha, but he does transform. So, like I said, you have transformations in between. All right, Super Kamehameha, aka the Chao Kamehameha. So this one is the same thing, but instead of B, you do L. So it's down forward, down forward L. Okay. So what does this one look like? All right, let's let's just mash until I pull it off here. Come on, come on. Hell yeah, we got it. Yeah. Oh, that's sick. Yeah. Fuck you, Vegeta. <laughs> that is. That is actually dope. So this was a level two, if I'm not mistaken. So you just mash like hell, and then when, whew, that noise, it's so bad. Like the the functionality. I think there's actually there's like a way to grab. I think in this game as well. Hold on, let me let me actually try this out here. <laughs> what the hell did you hear that? Oh, so I, I feel I have a feeling this actually had the ink, uh, the Japanese voices. Because it had a little bit, of, it had like these slight odd voice acting or whatever. Alright, so Goku actually has a third, a level 3 ult. And I think every single character does. Let's try out the Genki Dama. Yes, he's got the spirit bomb. Back, forward, wait, no, back, down, forward, up, L. The hell is, okay. Let's try it out. Oh, first try, let's go! My man just flew, oh, that's, this kind of cool. This kind of dope. I'm not gonna lie, bro. This is actually sick. Yo, let's go. How much damage? Damn, that motherfucker did like... Okay, that only did like 25% of his health. But <laughs> that was still pretty sick. Genki Dama. I like it. I like it a lot. Vegeta looked like he got something up his ass, man. Can, can, can you wipe your, your butt? Your butthole, man. This is scaring me. But you get the idea. It's pretty cool. Uh, I like the fact that you have the transformations, you know, in there. But... Um, this game is just is so bad. Like, just look at this. What? <laughs> that, this this fucking kick right here. Oh, oh, three hit combo. There are combos in this game. What the fuck? <laughs> Since when? I don't know how I did it. <laughs> I have no idea how I pulled off a combo like that. But hey, there you go. Oh, 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 oh. Yeah, I got no idea what the. There, there is probably a combo system, but. I digress. Um, this game is so bad to control. Let's let's go try some other ultimates because I think those are the most fun and the hardest to pull off. That's like the most challenging thing in the game. So um, let's go into uh, another favorite of mine. Let's try out some of Vegeta's. All right, so we got Vegeta here. So his his combo list is going to be a little bit more difficult if I'm not mistaken. So I think he's got like a Uzaru uh, power ball. Yeah, he does. He can transform the Uzaru from what I remember. So Gallic Gun. Down forward, down forward B. Okay, so his is, I think he's got sort of the same shit as uh, Goku in terms of like whatever he's using. So down forward, down forward B if I can pull off. So yeah, you can actually pull off some key blasts here. Goku, I think every single character has. Hey, there it is, Gallic Gun. So yeah, that <laughs> he flies up, does like a twist. I always thought that Vegeta's ult was the coolest. Like that was the most badass one because he does that shit. 
Like, what is that? He does a Whoa! and then a Gallic gun. Like, he does, like, this twirl. But I think it was supposed to be more like what you had in, uh, you know, the anime where Vegeta used Gallic gun for the first time or whatever. But, uh, hey, I mean, all I got to say is it's pretty badass whenever you pull it off. Yeah, that, that's 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 cool. I just got to keep using it because it's purple. <laughs> I like the purple color. All right, let's go to Max here. So that was Gallic Gun. Now, Big Bang Attack is down forward, down forward, L. Okay, so it is exactly the same. There it is. Let's go. Check this out. Yo, okay, so... <laughs> what the fuck? Wait, hold up. Huh? That was weird. That was like a... That was like a Gallic Gun Big Bang. Do you see that? Hold on. I got to see that one more time here. Hold on. Let me see that real quick. I don't I don't ever recall Vegeta going do, doing like a two-handed big what the fuck is that? Are you Vegito? Vegito does that or Gogeta. Like they do two-handed big bang. You do it one hand, Vegeta. What are you trying to go against your 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 properties? What's wrong with you, bruh? This man trying to go against tradition. Alright, now for the fun one. So it's the same exact thing I think as Goku's. It's back down, forward, up L for Zaru. I, if I pull this off first try, I'll be extremely happy. Let's see. fuck yeah, let's go, let's go. This is yo, look at this. This man throws a moon up in the air. He jump in the air, and we return to Monk. <laughs> Dead ass. I'm not even joking. That is the coolest freaking ult ever. But since when does Vegeta? When is he able to do that without his goddamn Uzaru tail? Like, what? Who? Who thought that was... Who decided that this was legal? Is this legal? Are we legalizing this game? I mean, the cover is green like... Like, mere Joanna. So, why not at this point? But yeah, um... Now, for my final one. This is the most difficult one to pull off. Android 18. I'm gonna show you guys why... The main reason why I wanted to do this video. I'm gonna be real. This is the main reason why. Let's let's jump into eight, A18. Alright, guys. I am in this mode with android 18 now the most notorious thing about her is that she has she has ass rockets okay and you might be thinking what is that what what does that even mean no she literally shoots rockets from her ass like kamikaze bombs from her asshole yes that's the thing but it's so funny when you do it it's the dumbest looking thing ever she never did this in the anime but let's see if i can actually pull it off oh first try Let's go! <laughs> what is that? She she shoots. She shoots triple ass rockets. When did she do that? Is, is this something I'm missing? I, I think I think it is something I'm missing. Look look look. Okay, this is actually a lot easier than I thought it was gonna be. Oh my god! Rest in peace, Krillin. Like. It could have been something a little bit cooler. She could have, like, shot him from her hand or something. I, I think what they were going for was it was supposed to be, like, shooting from her back. But it ended up looking like shit, and they did a bad job of it. <laughs> and then you ended up getting this crap, bruh. Like, I don't even... Oh, my God. It's it's bad. But we got to do Swoley, my boy Broly, because Broly's cool, and he actually transforms into Swoley. We have to do it. Alright guys, we got my boy Swoley. He's gonna be a little bit difficult to pull off. I just looked at his ultimate, like, controls. And they are intimidating, I'm not gonna lie. So, I'm gonna try my best to do what I can with this. It's just like, like I said, it's just like a mashing fest. Hey, we got it! Nice! Yo, look at- <laughs> What? <laughs> what the fuck was that, bro? I don't even know- what I was looking at. What e I have to see it again. Oh, gross. So he actually goes <clears throat> just regular Super Saiyan. Like, I mean, it's legendary, but like he's got he's got yellow hair, which is kind of cool to see. I like it. <laughs> All right, let's go into the special modes. All right, guys, to uh, quickly end off this video, I wanted to go into some of the little special, like, extras that they had, which this is a very cool feature. Again, I want to see more Dragon Ball games have stuff like this. Like, even a game like, for example, like Dragon Ball Xenoverse, um, they stopped kind of doing those, like, references and cool little, like, things that you can, like, just go into that are extra and all that stuff. So let's go to the image gallery. Um, it's just random. Like, I don't know why they did this, but it's kind of cool. So um, they tried to... I guess integrate some of like really cool iconic screenshots from uh, I guess the anime and stuff but they ended up looking like shit anyways like the, the pixels look horrendous but hey it's on <laughs> it's on Game Boy so 
We have Super Saiyan, Vegeta. We got Android 18 and number 16. I believe these are actually all the characters that are featured in the game. Um, only the characters that are featured in the game. So you have Goku going Super Saiyan 3 for the first time. Uh, Android 18 kissing Krillin. Like, these are all real iconic shots. Yeah, the Great Saiyan, because it's Great Saiyan and Gohan that you use in this game. Uh, versus one of the crooks or whatever. I think that's in one of the intros. Uh, you have Nappa just like that, okay? Um, Frieza, of course. You gotta get the Frieza Force. Uh, Trunks looking like a badass, you know, holding up that, uh, death ball from Frieza for the first time. Looking like a true warrior. And we got my boy Piccolo taking off his armor. Oh, I was say his armor. His his way to training clothing. Again, Piccolo versus Android 17. One of the best all-time anime fights, in my opinion. Uh, we also have Raditz. Looks like shit. It looks so bad. Uh, Vegeta versus 18. We got Super Boo getting all pissed off. He's going to blow himself up versus Ultimate Gohan. Uh, we have Vegeta going Super Saiyan for the first time. Uh, does Android let yourself experience fear? You know, that shit. Uh, Boo scaring the absolute dick off of my boy Bobbity here uh we have cell and perfect cell which you meet for the first time uh then you have perfect cell charging up go tanks going super saiyan 3 for the first time uh trunks doing a sword slash then we have broly swirly out here uh and this one's hilarious i i always thought this shot was hilarious because um <laughs> his mouth is so big dude like that he does his megaton punch shout out to mr satan so those are all the images that you get from there. Um, there is a jukebox. You can listen to all the music. So if you wanted to hear some of the music and maybe kind of connect it to what you have in game or whatever. So you have obviously the very first intro theme. It's the same exact song uh, from Legacy of Goku 2, which was the intro to the original Dragon Ball Z anime for America. Then you have the conclusion. Pretty mediocre, but it's cool. Uh, Namek. All of these are kind of based off of actual tracks from Bruce Falconer, if I'm not mistaken. So, let's go to this one. You'll know Kami's Lookout. Ready? This is like Gohan's theme, I think. Back in the day. A1. A1. Oh, I love this song, dude. Alright, Inside Boo. Inside Boo's always got like a very disgusting, eerie theme, but I like this one. It's pretty cool. I prefer Budokai 3's Inside Boo theme. That one's epic. Yeah, you can tell this is the same uh, developers from Legacy of Goku and Boo's Fury and all that. Uh, I think it's Webfoot Technologies. It's got the same type of music. Here, let's listen to this one. Go Go Goku. I think this is on Master Roshi stage. I like this one a lot because it has sort of a I don't I don't want to say Gohan's like main theme that he kind of, it's like almost like a remix of Gohan's uh Ultimate Gohan's theme or whatever similar to it. All right, Wasteland. This one's pretty good. All right, Orange City. The one that I've listened to my whole life. And then there's Snake Way. This one sounds like something from, like, James Bond or something. <laughs> but yeah, you get the idea with that. Uh, let's go to our uh, bios, alright? Let's 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 just read a couple of these. So, as you can see, the icons on all these characters are all straight up taken from Legacy of Goku 2. Because these all came out around the same time. I think Legacy of Goku 2 came out, like... Maybe a couple of months or whatever before this one. But born a Saiyan named Kakarot. He was originally sent to Earth to destroy it. I'm not going to read all of it. Uh, you have Gohan here. His, his face looks hilarious. Bro. They all look like they have something up their ass. I, I can't stop saying that. Affectionately named after his adoptive grandfather. Gohan is Goku and Chi Chi's son. We have Piccolo here. Uh, we got Krillin. Android 18, which her icon looks a little bit different, I think. Uh, Trunks. Same icon again, Vegeta and Piccolo, they all had the same icon, even Krillin, uh, all from, um, I think, Legacy Goku 2. Now, Gohan's icon wasn't in there because Legacy Goku 2 did not take place in the Boo Saga. Then you have Frieza, same icon. Uh, I think, yeah, Android 16, same thing. Cell looks to be different, actually. I'm not sure why Cell's icon is different. That's not the same one. That might be the Japanese one, I think. Uh, Go Tanks again, Nobu's, uh, you know, saga in that, but I mean, he's in this game. 
It says, wait, what did that say? Metamoru art. The Metamor, it's not Metamoran, Metamoru. I, I, I guess translations were bad. Uh, Boo, Boo looks. I used to think his name was Ba. This is the first time I saw Boo was in this game. Then we have Broly, which I like his icon a lot. Broly is an exceptional Saiyan. He was born Super Saiyan. Born, born at the same moment as Goku. He harbored a mysterious resentment toward him. Broly's father tried to use him as a weapon to rule the universe, but eventually his power was too strong and he broke the control mechanism, blah, 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 and then he's dead. Uh, Nappa looks hilarious and then Raditz as well, but... Yeah, you get it. Um, those are all the modes, I guess. Uh, you had some bonus settings where you could, like, you know, fuck around with this kind of stuff. You could have invisible mode, which I don't know what the point of that would be. I mean, might as well be invisible because you can't even play the game properly. And you had sky battles and stuff, which I never knew how to pull that shit off. But those were stupid anyways, dude. But, yeah, uh, other than that, guys, that is going to be it for this video. I know it was a little bit more of a longer one, but I wanted to... Uh, relive the experience I had and share with you guys my experience from one of the worst Dragon Ball games I've ever played. I still think this game sucks absolute donkey dick, but I mean coming back to it uh, older as an adult now, I guess um, I was just a stupid lazy impatient kid and I didn't want to spend the time to learn the actual controls of the game. So uh, I took a little bit of time before this video to learn it a little bit more and um, I feel like I feel like I could play this a little bit better, but uh, pretty pretty fun as a video. Thank you again. Again, if you guys like this video, show your support. Leave a like, subscribe, ring that notification bell. And every single Wednesday, I'll be bringing you guys another new Wild Wednesday. Take care. Stay safe. <laughs> this is Broly. And you are watching Slow Plays. Make sure to subscribe or else I'll destroy your entire planet. <laughs>